one of the things that the, that uh, Tuatua does when you have it frequently is that it brings a very strong bond between a husband and a wife. So when the two of you are moving on in the journey of life, you are so united, not only united on Tua Tua, your bodies only, but also your soul level and also your spirit man. So you benefit spirit, soul and body. And that was the original plan of God when he introduced us to sex. He wanted man to enjoy the three dimension in him. And so when you deny each other to a tour, and we have been told that this is a, a responsibility that you cannot delegate, then you are doing disservice to your partner. And so what are we talking about? When people understand the benefits of Tua Tua, then you are able to stay on course even when the feelings are actually against that. And that's why it's very important to work on our mindset, you know. And the only way to work on our mindset and our mentality is using the word of God. Because it is the same word that we have just been read to in the book of uh, uh, 1 Corinthians 7 verse 1 to 5 that we should not, you know, defraud each other. You know, we should not, um, my body does not belong to myself. My body belongs to Pastor Monene. And so anytime Pastor Monene needs to adore, I should be available for him. Unless there is something, you know, physically that is quite impossible for us to have it. And if it's so, then the Bible says, even if it is fasting, we should do it with the consent and quickly return and have to adore Otherwise, we shall be opening the door for the enemy. Yes. So the word of God yes. tells us how to handle sex. Mm -hmm. Tells us how to handle sex as a husband and a wife. Yes. And it's very important to follow the word of God because as long as it is in the Bible, it is important for both of us.